The RTA believes that everyone deserves to enjoy a night as big as the Buck Days Illuminated Night Parade. They tell 3 News that accessibility is always on the forefront of their mind. It is part of our mission and vision to help our community, and that's what we're here for. So we want to make sure that everyone enjoys it. We have this prime location, and we wanted to share that area. Right in front of their building between Waco and Staple Street is where Corpus Christi RTA will be offering an accessible viewing section for those with disabilities and their families to view the Buck Days Night Parade. We wanted to make sure that they could have a, a designated area that is a safe zone for them. We have security in the area. We designate it for them and their family, uh, uh, up to six people. Dr. Jennifer Scott with the city's Committee for Persons with Disabilities says offering a space for people who may have a hard time navigating a crowded event can truly make a difference between a difficult and memorable experience. Accessibility is important. If they don't feel like they can go somewhere because there's no accessibility, then they're not truly included in the community. Scott believes the experience RTA is offering makes all the difference for those who may otherwise sit out on an event like the Buck Days Night Parade because of safety or mobility concerns. I mean, how are they supposed to enjoy the parade or be included in, you know, community events like that if there's not accessible places for them? So I, I feel like it's really a great thing that they're doing because that is inclusive of our community. Now, RTA tells 3 News that there will be space for a little over 100 people in the accessible viewing section. Those interested will need to have a wristband to enter and sit in that section. Those with disabilities or their family members can call RTA customer service at the number on your screen to schedule a pickup of those wristbands. The deadline to pick those up is 3 p.m. on Friday, May 3rd. For more information, you can visit their website. We'll have a link to that along with our story on our website.